In our Health Watch report, some immune diseases cause the intestines to become inflamed and can cause a lot of pain. In addition to regular medicine and surgery, IBD specialists are exploring the connection between the mind and gut. Local 3's Shelley Botat has more. 1.6 million Americans struggle with inflammatory bowel disease. Now, some specialists are treating the gut by starting with the mind. Oh, hi, Mary Lou. Mary Lou Wellbrock Reeves has seen many doctors and specialists throughout her lifelong struggle with Crohn's disease. Some of my days are racked with such pain that it's analogous to labor pain. Her family is what keeps her going as she searches for the best way to live with a condition that has no cure. I'm going to have you stare at that wall. For Mary Lou, that includes what's called gastric directed hypnotherapy. The um, brain and the gut are really connected through the vagus nerve, which is responsible for communicating a whole bunch of functions, um, including, you know, how fast things move through your um, body, how much you process waste, how much inflammation. And as I count, your eyelids will get heavy. Crohn's disease isn't caused by stress, but stress can amplify the symptoms. You visualize a thick, cool, protective coating. It's spreading through your stomach and through your intestines. For Mary Lou, hypnosis is one part of a whole body approach to managing her disease. I think people still think it's a magic act. It's not a magic act. It's really a heavy focus. It's a heavy emphasis on focus and self-focus. When a patient is in a very focused state of attention, their brain is much more open to suggestion than it would be in a normal setting. Hypnosis helps Mary Lou with things like behavioral and dietary changes, along with traditional treatment to help keep her Crohn's in control. Hypnosis for patients with digestive issues is offered at several other major hospital systems around the U.S. and is often covered by insurance. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 3 News.